We don't need to be afraid of our bodies. I think so often that the very cravings, wants, and needs of our bodies scare us. So it's easier to put a cap on it. It's easier to say, well, beneath, you know, from the neck down is this sort of strange territory that's always getting me in trouble. It doesn't look the way I want it to look. It doesn't do what I want. It doesn't behave and lose weight when I'm trying so hard. And it gains weight so quickly when I barely breathe over a chocolate eclair. I'm afraid of my body. And the antidote? is to make friends with our bodies right now with all the things that we like and the things that we don't what's in the way of making friends right now with your body because you know why friends can work together an enemy isn't someone that's going to work with you and you want your body to work with you in harmony with you helping you translated into physical terms that means enhancing your metabolism, strengthening your endocrine system, streamlining your digestive system. So you see, these pieces that we're talking about are emotional pieces because that's where we start. You know, we are emotional beings. But one of the things that I think is so fascinating is, and the journey I'm going to be taking you on in this conversation, if, we, if you continue with me with this conversation, is into the nature of our body and how we make friends with our body. What is our body asking of us? And as we answer the questions, we discover a new relationship with our body, a body that we're not afraid of.